We go to the first game under the lights here at Wilkins Field. And Mountain Lakes defense is fired up. Watch Anthony Smith come up and make the stop on third and 11, forcing a Madison punt. And on its next possession, watch Mountain Lakes quarterback Brad Smith drop back. Then he takes off and watch him use that great athletic ability. And he uses a couple of cross moves here for a 64-yard touchdown. And Mountain Lakes has a 6-0 lead after one quarter of play in this big Morris County showdown. All right, second quarter we go, and Mountain Lakes gets the ball back, and the give is to Brad Landry, and watch him shake the tackler in the backfield before he's off to the races for a 35-yard touchdown, and the Herd has a 12-0 lead at the half. We move to third quarter action, and Mountain Lakes picks up where it left off, and this time watch Bobby Forley pop to the outside, and he races down the far sideline for a 78-yard touchdown, and it's all the Herd here, 18-0 early in the third quarter. Madison looks to get back in this one, and it's quarterback A.J. Schmitz with the first down run on third and four to the 21-yard line before Sean Breslauer drags him down. And the Dodgers get on the scoreboard here. Watch quarterback A.J. Schmitz hit David Lutlinger in stride on the seam pattern for the 20-yard touchdown strike, and Madison trails 18-7 after three quarters of play. Madison needs to get the ball back, and on third and seven, watch Dom Lapino chase down Mountain Lakes quarterback Brad Smith for the sack, forcing a punt here in the fourth quarter. And the Dodgers capitalize here on the quarterback keep, watch A.J. Schmitz with the 25-yard touchdown scamper, and Madison trails 18-13 midway through the fourth. And it's A.J. Schmitz crashing in for the two-point conversion, and all of a sudden we have a ball game as Mountain Lakes holds a 23-15 lead over the Dodgers. Okay, Mountain Lakes is looking to eat some clock up, and they get a big first down here to keep the drive going on this five-yard run by Bobby Frawley. All right, huge play here on third and 16 from the 42. Watch Brad Smith zip it to Jimmy Schick for the first down, and with a roughing the passer penalty, at 15 more yards, and it's first and 10, Mountain Lakes at the Madison 29. And the herd wraps up the opening night victory here on this 30-yard touchdown run by Brad Landry as Mountain Lakes holds off a tough Madison squad 24-15. All summer we were just focused on Madison, uh, the last team that uh, beat us and you know we were just focused on getting it back for some of the kids that, uh, that didn't get to finish it off last uh, two years ago. It's great to get it done. Uh, our goal from, day, from uh, back in the preseason has been 1-0. Uh, wasn't exactly pretty but we got it done and that was our goal. The main thing about our entire offense is our O-line and I feel like as a running back, it's pretty easy when you have a great line like that, just block a three, open up those huge holes. I mean, all you got to do is run. I mean. Just a tremendous night for our community. I'm so proud of our, our kids. Uh, you know, we talked about all summer, you know, first night under the lights. Uh, you know, our parents went out, they raised this money. Our community did this just tremendous job. So to, to have such an event here in our town, we said we have great football people. The, the, you see the crowd, the parents, the, the players, you know, we're, we're just so connected into this football program. So to come out and play the way we did, you know, we knew Madison's a, you know, a great football team. And, and our, our coaches did a tremendous job. You know, Coach Stanzione, Coach Wallace defensively, uh, Coach Reed, Coach Cap. Uh, Don Olosky, Lane, all our guys was just tremendous. And then our, our seniors, you know, this, we have 26 seniors who, who really committed to this program, and uh, they don't all get to play tonight. Uh, you know, it's first week. Uh, I got to do a better job as a head coach in terms of getting our, you know, substitution and guys on the field, and we'll do that. We'll go back. You know, now that we got a full game, we can and look and, and evaluate and get better as coaches. But I'm just so proud of our kids. This, this was a great way. Look, to be 1-0 here on this Friday night was, was pretty special.